Hi guys, I'm Chiffon, pronounced like the material, and welcome to my channel. If you're new to my channel, I make videos all about health, beauty, and fashion. And today I'm sharing with you guys some of my favorite scents that do not irritate my dry, sensitive, eczema prone skin and my seasonal allergies. So if you're, if you're interested in watching that, keep on watching. Okay guys, so you already know, or if you don't know already, I have dry, sensitive, eczema prone skin and I do have seasonal allergies. So growing up, I didn't wear any perfume at all. I was, everything was like scentless. So Dove soap, no scent, lotion, no scent. Um, and I actually did a skin um, body, like skincare, um, pro went over some body and skincare products that I use for my skin. If you're interested in watching that, scroll through some of my videos. But everything was scentless. And I started to wear perfume maybe like a year, maybe two years now. Isn't that crazy? At this big age, <laughs> I just started wearing perfumes because I don't know, it makes me feel cute, I guess. So I wanted to wear scents that were kind of like light and they didn't irritate my skin because initially I would spray the perfume. When I started spraying perfume, I would just put it on my clothes because I was scared to put it on my skin because I didn't want to get a rash or anything like that. And one day I was just like, Chiffon, just go for it. Because you know when you spray stuff on your skin, your, your, your natural body scent mixes in with the perfume and it basically makes a personalized scent for you. And that's what I wanted. I wanted everything to be personal. So, sorry for all these hair flips. Um, I just got layers in my hair and like now the hair sometimes come forward like that, but I really do love the layers. But anywho, sorry. Um, so, what was I saying? Anyway, I started wearing, I started spraying them on my skin and I haven't had any issues with them. So I just wanted to share them with you guys if this was a concern for you. So my first scent is, um, this is the Valentino Intense. And here is the bottle. It is super cute, guys. And then that's the top. And I'll turn it. It smells so good. So this is the 30 milliliter bottle and it's $80. Mm. This is like a date night perfume. So it has like a bourbony, vanilla type of smell. And I actually like my house to smell like this. It just makes me fall in love. I highly recommend wearing this for like a date night or something like this. Like I definitely want to wear this to work because like, I don't want people falling in love with me. <laughs> but yeah, I highly recommend. I spray it on my neck and in, in, in the middle of my... Um, what is this, the wrist? <laughs> and uh, it lasts all day. It's very, a, a full body scent. Okay guys, so this is the second scent. This is the Donna Born in Roma by Valentino. As you can see, like Valentino puts their common, like um, those little, I don't know, horns or whatever they are on their bottles. As you can see on the one that I just showed you too. See how it has those little triangle cone things. Um, but yeah, this bottle is so cute. So this is 30 milliliters and this is 80 mils. No, excuse me, $80. And guys, I'm a sucker for like bourbon vanilla scents. Mm, oh my gosh, it smells so good. Um, yeah, it's another bourbon vanilla scent, but it's very different than the other Valentino scent. Um, it's still like a floral scent. I highly recommend. Again, I put this scent on my skin as well. No rash. This is the scent that you wear like um, on a date night or you're going out with your girlfriends and you just want to smell good. This lasts all night. It's a full body scent and I highly recommend. Okay, guys. So my next scent is this. Uh, Chance the Chanel perfume. So this is the Chance girl. This is in French. I don't even know. I'm gonna spell it for you. E A U. However you say that. Tendre T E N D R E. I'll put it on the screen. 
um, but I really like this bottle. It's very simple and I really like how they engrave the information on the metal rim of the bottle. And this is 35 milliliters and it was $72. So this was an EDT scent where the other two scents were EDP. So um, this is like more light. And uh, let's see, it says it has fresh, fresh fruity florals and a little citron. Mm, yeah, I can smell a little citron, but this is very fresh. I typically wear this scent, and again, I put it on my skin, no irritation. I wear this scent when I'm going to like a business meeting or I have a presentation to give because it makes me feel so confident. So I definitely put this on when I got to get stuff done, like, like professional. Okay, guys, so the next scent, y'all yeah, should probably already know this one. It's been around. So this is the y YSL Mon Paris. It is an EDP as well, so it does last all day. As you can see, it has the YSL charm there. This is the bottom. And I really like this scent. So as y'all can see, <laughs> this is one of the only ones that I have a big belt bottle of it. And I typically don't buy scents in this big bottle. So this was gifted. <laughs> so I had this for like so long because I don't, I don't wear it every day. But um, I really do love this scent. So it's for floral, fruity floral. I mean, I don't know how to explain it, but it's floral with a little hint of sweetness and like fresh, I don't know, berries, like very light um, and like airy. So I do wear this to work sometimes or I'll wear it out, you know, for brunch or a nice spring day because it's just light and airy and that's the way it makes me feel. So, yeah. I do this recommend. This is Marc Jacob Daisy Love. So um, this is the Daisy Love So Sweet. And like I, I say, you guys already know because it has a flyer top, like Marc Jacob is like, you know, famous for doing that, but the bottle's so cute. It's a light pink or, I don't know, can look purple to some people. But I've always liked Marc Jacob perfumes. Like this perfume is very sweet. Um, So this is, Marc Jacob is one of the first perfumes that I've ever got. Um, And I think that's because I really like sweet smells when I was a little bit younger so um yeah it's just very sweet a little floral but it's definitely sweet so if you like sweet scents I, I i recommend getting this but as i age i feel like i like more vanilla softy or bourbon scents so i don't reach for this scent as much as i used to but I definitely spray it on my skin, no irritation. And it's just something to have. I'll definitely keep this. Okay guys, so this last one is the Gucci Guilty Pore Film EDT. So it's very light. As you can see, the Gucci Guilty is engraved into the bottle and then Gucci at the top. And I literally wear this scent almost every day. It's like light, fresh. Let's see, the words they use are floral, amber floral. Yeah, it's like light and fresh, but not like too springy. It's just like fresh. And I literally wear this almost every day to work because it's not like you have to be up on me to smell it. And I don't want to get off a strong scent at clinic because like, you know, people got allergies and stuff, and I ain't trying to aggravate all that. But anywho, it is one, I, I got the 1.6 ounce, and it's $85. So this is at Ulta, and it smells so good. I'm going to wear this right now, actually. Yeah, this is that girl. Okay, guys, so those are the perfumes that I have that I actually have sprayed on my dry, sensitive, eczema-prone skin, and it hasn't irritated my skin 
or my seasonal allergies. So I recommend trying them out and they all smell so good. It just depends on like where you're going and what type of mood you're trying to, you know, what type of vibe you're trying to set. <laughs> so I highly recommend checking them out. I'll link them down in the description box below. And if you like this video, please like it by giving it a thumbs up. And if you have subscribed to me, thank you. And if you haven't, girl, subscribe to me if you want to see more of me. And thanks for watching. Peace and love.